Okay, let's review our box method for division. We want to remember our little saying, does McDonald's sell cheese burgers? And what this means is first I should divide, then I should multiply, then subtract, I want to check it, and then bring up my number. So let's start with a problem. My first problem is 4 into 7,368. Now I'm going to draw my boxes. One thing that I might do that helps me is to make my boxes a little bit longer. Then I can just do my work in there. So the first thing I want to think about is what times 4 gets me close to 7, or 7 divided by 4. So first I'm dividing. 4 goes into 7 one time. Now I have to multiply. 1 times 4 equals 4. My next step says I should subtract. 7 minus 4 equals 3. Now I check. My 3 is less than 4. Now I bring up my number. Okay, I am done with this. Now I want to think. I have 33. 33 divided by 4. What number times 4 is close to 33 without going over? 8. 8. So I divided. Now I multiply. 8 times 4 is 32. Now I subtract. 33 minus 32 equals 1. I check. My 1 is smaller than 4. Now I can bring that up. Now I'm done with that one. Now I want to think. I have 16 divided by 4. So first divide. 4 goes into 16 four times. Now I multiply. 4 times 4. So 4 times 4 equals 16. Now I subtract. 16 minus 16 is 0. I check 0 is less than 4. I can bring that up. Now I want to think. I have 8. 8 divided by 4. That equals 2. Now I divide it. My next step is to multiply. 2 times 4 equals 8. Now I subtract. 8 minus 8 is 0. I check. That's smaller. And I don't have anywhere else to go with this number. And because it's 0, there is no remainder. Okay, we're going to try one more. Does McDonald's sell cheese burgers? Divide, multiply, subtract, check, bring up my number. Okay, this time we're going to go 2 into 5,426. Again, I'm going to make longer boxes. Okay, so my first thing I want to do is 5 divided by 2. 2 will go into 5 two times. So I divided. Now I want to multiply. 2 times 2 equals 4. 
Now I subtract 5 minus 4 equals 1. I check this number is less than this number, so now I bring it up. I have 14. Okay, now I want to think of 14. 14 divided by 2. Okay, so that would be 7. Now I multiply. 7 times 2 equals 14. Then I subtract. 14 minus 14 is 0. I check. That is less than 2. I bring up my number. 0. Now I'm ready to move on. I have 2 divided by 2. That is 1. I divided. Now I multiply. 1 times 2 equals 2. Now I subtract. 2 minus 2 is 0. I check. That is less than 2. I bring up my number. Because it's 0, I really don't have to bring it up, and since I don't have room here, I'm just going to leave it at 6. So now I have 6 divided by 2. That would be 3. So I divided. Next thing is I multiply. 3 times 2 equals 6. Then I subtract. 6 minus 6 is 0. I check. I can bring that. I don't even need to bring it up. My answer is 2,713. We're going to try one more. Does McDonald's sell cheese burgers? Divide, multiply, subtract, check, bring up. My next problem is 6 into 7,246. So I'm going to draw my boxes. Okay, and I am ready. So first I want to think, I want to divide 7. Six, 7 divided by 6, 1. 6 will go into 7 one time. So divide. Now I multiply 1 times 6 equals 6. Then I subtract. 7 minus 6 equals 1. Then I check. 1 is less than 6. So now I can bring it up. 1. Now I'm starting again. I have 12 divided by 6. My missing fact friend for 12 and 6 is 2. 6 will go into 12 2 times. So I divide it. Now I multiply. 2 times 6 equals 12. Now I subtract. 12 minus 12 equals 0. I check that is less than 6, so I can move it up. In this case, because it's 0 and 0 is technically nothing, I'm not going to put my 0 here because I really, now I understand that this is just 4. Now I have to divide. But I'm noticing, if I only have 4, I can't make a group of 6. So 4 divided by 6 is 0. I can't do that. So then I multiply. 0 times 6 equals 0. Then I subtract. 4 minus 0 is 4. I check. This 4 is smaller than 6. So now I bring it up. So now I have 46 divided by 6. Hmm. I need to get close to 46 without going over. That would be 7. So 46 divided by 6 is 7 because 7 times 6 equals 42. That gets me close without going over. Now I subtract. 6 minus 2 is 4. I check. That is less than 6. So I bring up my number. I have nothing left, so I have a remainder of 
4. And there you have it. 1,207 remainder 4. That would be my answer.